hello everyone welcome to this video in the previous video we have learned that what is a projection operator so you already know that a projection is when when do we call uh, an operator to be a projection operator whenever it is self adjoint and it is idempotent right now in this video we shall be looking at this product of projection so can we say that if we multiply two projections which are individually projections right so is the project uh, is the product also a projection or not so the answer to this is that the product of projections that may not be a projection right and in fact we have a theorem here stating this thing that whenever in connection with the products or when we apply or do a composite of projections on a given hilbert space then the following two statement holds because product in case of operators that is basically composing two operators together so the first statement here it tells us that if we have the composite of two projections the product of two projections and we are calling that by the name p if this is a projection on h which is the given hilbert space this would be a projection whenever so let's see what are the conditions here for any projection to be any product to be a projection so the condition here is that the projections p1 and p2 they should commute with each other so that means p1 p2 should be equal to p2 p1 this is one thing and another thing the product projection so p it should project the given hilbert space h on to some space now what is this closed space this is the intersection of two spaces y1 and y2 y1 is the space where p1 projects h on to y1 and y2 is that space where p2 projects the given hilbert space on to y2 right so here the product would be projected towards the their intersection so this is the first point and the second point here tells us that whenever we have two closed subspaces one is the y subspace one is v subspace so if now we are given uh, this hilbert space and within this hilbert space let's see we have y as some closed subspace and v as some closed subspace of this space then both of these spaces they would be orthogonal to each other whenever the corresponding projections would satisfy this thing so that means the projection on on to y and the projection on to v whenever multiplied together they would result into zero and what is this zero this is the zero operator right this is the zero operator so this is what is the result with us in this particular case well this is the result about the product of projections now in the next video we shall be looking at the proof for this particular theorem well that is it for this video thank you for watching